how to use streak crm free crm software for gmail hi guys welcome back today i will show you how to use streak crm for your gmail where you will be able to track your emails add different labels for your crm and merge emails so let's get started first what you have to do is you will simply go to streak.com and you will land on this platform right here streak is available as a chrome extension and it is completely free you will be able to manage your mails with streak let's go to products really quickly and let me actually show you how crm works so when it comes to streak crm i will be able to manage any workflow from my inbox we have sales project management business fundraising support hiring real estate and full customization needs and i will be able to track my email so let's go ahead and add this to our chrome so that i can use streak with my gmail simply open up your web store simply click right here and it will open up your extension web store now you have to click right here on add to chrome add extension and it will be added to your chrome you can see right here now i have my streak crm for a gmail as an extension i can simply go ahead and pin this extension from here there you go let's pin this one so now it has automatically opened up my gmail because now i have my streak crm available as an extension here when you click on your extension now you have to sign in with your google account the gmail where you want to add this extension to now streak wants to access your google account where it will be able to read and compose my email google calendar and others simply allow and then your streak will be added right here now we have to select that what do you want to use streak for crm email tracking mail merge streak share and other so i want to use it for my crm how many people on your team so we are six to ten people now please leave your phone number and someone on your team will reach out to you asap so if you're interested in the demo then you will simply add your phone number right here but you can s simply skip this stuff then we have how would best describe your role you simply have to select your role in your team so i am actually a small business owner where are you importing data from when it comes to streak and gmail we know that we have to import data so they're asking about our main data source if it's crm then you might be using any crm platform such as salesforce hubspot or pipe drive well for now i'm not gonna add my crm platform but i will select google sheets then we have how did you hear about streak so it depends on you how you have actually heard uh, about streak from google search podcast friend or colleague twitter or i don't remember so let's go ahead just type in google search now streak will actually analyze your inbox and they will actually show you that what are your contacts and what are the companies you can actually skip this step for now if you want to and then you can simply go ahead and take the tour really quickly but for now i'm gonna skip this so now my streak has been added right here and i am good to go so this is how it looks we have all of these different boxes right here such as lead contacted pitched demo negotiating closed and closed one to add a new box like this all i have to do is click right here and click on add box now i can simply go ahead and add a box let's add a box name as completed click enter and a new box will be added right here then to check a box what you have to do is simply click right here and and this is a box that i need to go for so this is lead i can simply click right here and add different emails and different information in my lead then we have contacted paged this way so for lead i can simply go ahead and add as many details as i want to let's add another one task two so now you can see right here i have two contact or tasks in my lead if i want to go for maybe closed let's go ahead to close and add right here this way you can simply go ahead and add emails and information right here you can also move any of the box wherever you want to 
Then to quick add, you simply click right here. And this allows you to quickly add different companies and different contexts right here. For example, I can simply go ahead and select this one and add it right here in my closed. Click enter and this company will be added right here. And now I have two in my closed. This is the company that I added. This is how you simply add different email addresses and contacts from here from your Gmail to your Streak CRM. Then we have the other option which is import. Import allows us to choose file from our spreadsheet because this is my data source that I added. You simply select different list or different emails from your spreadsheet. Then we have this option as well which is directly linked to this pipeline and they will be able to get access to this pipeline right here. This is the total count of all of the different emails that I have. We have different filters such as name, lead source, priority, deal size, company, close data as well. You can simply filter your search from here. Then we have these three dots right here. In here, we get pipeline visualization. I can simply click right here and we can actually go for pie chart, line chart or column chart as well. Let's go to pie chart and you will see that I will get a pie chart for my different list right here. We can simply go ahead and add different views as well. Then we have stages. Integration and automation allows you to add different integrations and automate your work. Then we have export, reports option right here and news feed. You can simply go ahead and create your own CRM hub right here with your Gmail. And it is really easy to use as well. Streak has a lot of different tools and features for you to help you customize your Gmail and create an amazing CRM of your own. This way you will be able to manage your business and grow your business better. So yeah guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you and now you know everything that you wanted to know. And don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if this tutorial was a big help to you. I tried to tell you everything about the topic and I hope that you understood everything and now you are good to go. And don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to. Also, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel. The button will be given right down below. Go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video. So yeah, also leave a comment down below what was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question. So yeah guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you and now you know how to use Shriek with your Gmail. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.